Kyle traffic, check one five echo, left base runway one nine, flank kill. Okay. I really hope it didn't cut off that Madivac flight. <laughs> yeah. We are All a little right. off, I'm gonna get back on the runway. Alright. Montreal, sun wing, uh, four one. Three landing checks, car peats on, mags are on, masters on, landing lights on. Yep. Stick will go back and feet will be alive. Alright. Yeah, just confirm that south one problem. Three point landing. All three wheels. Yeah, Montreal, sir, you're getting stepped on. I confirm my uh, South 1 Bravo for uh, Sunwing 415. Nice job. Good correction with the flare was a little high, right? Yeah, yep. here we come. Then you kind of rode it in, let the ground come up to you. That was really good. All right, let's do another one. All right. It wants to fly, doesn't it? There's 55. That's smooth. There's 55. Let it go. Yeah, let it fly. So it kind of hits that whoop de do just as you're about at 55, and you kind of just do what you just did. You let it kind of hit the bump, bounce you up in the air, and you're flying at 55. Yeah. Fuel is good, mixture, primers all set, landing lights on, south car beats out. Report to Juliet is uh, turning left uh, base from a one nine south Albany. Wheeled landing, wheeled. Again, you might have to slip it to get down a glide path after the trees. Yep. All right. So you're gonna apply left aileron, right rudder on the slip. Left aileron, right rudder. Nice job, keep flying it. Yep, keep that nose at 70. Nice. Yep, perfect. That can add your power into 1500. Yep, keep flying it. Keep flying it. 1500 RPM. Hold it. Yep. No, nope. stay with it. Stay with it. I want you to figure this out. Yep. Right, you can, can, add, can still add a little power, right, if you need to, yeah. just to maintain that directional control. And now back. Peter alive. Nice. So I could tell you were going to go around, and that is totally yeah. fine, but I wanted you to feel, you know, as your experience gets better with handling the, the up and down of that gear. But... You know, if it's always, you know, it's always prudent to go around if you need to. Yeah. Go. You ready to go? All right. There's 50, 55. Nice.
Clank Hill traffic, jump 15 Echo, final runway 19, Clank Hill. Head back to 70, anything checks, mixture, car heat, trim, primer, lights are all set. Wheel landing, wheel landing. Why is it? RPM about 20 feet off the ground. All right. Yep, we go right around that tree, line up on the center line, go to the left a little bit. RPM. Yep, fly to the left, fly to the left. Get straight, yep, there you go. Perfect. Yep, hold it forward. Just, yep, keep flying it. Let's see, I pushed enough full wet rudder. Yep, stick back all the way back. Perfect. Good job. So all I did on that one was uh, push in that left rudder at that one point where the tail felt like it was moving a little bit. Yeah. But it felt like you were pushing it with me at the same time. Yeah, I, I saw it and I was just like reacted to it. Yep. Doing a great job holding heading on that departure with the wind. Very good. It's like when soon as you go above the trees, it just hits you just all at once. Yeah. Well. Yep. Southwest. I don't know. It was a thousand feet above them, and I had full power in, and could not climb at all. I was. I mean, I wasn't sinking at all, but I could not climb at all. It was just enough of a down draft that was holding me right in position. And as soon as I got on the other side of it, it changed to a down draft. And uh, in the other way, so it was a tailwind down draft. And then I started cruising along a little faster. That's kind of the way it works. Usually one side is uh, a, you know, a down draft that's going to pull you down. And the other side is a downdraft that's going to make you go faster. Yeah. All right, so we're going to touch the upwind wheel down. We're going to hold it on that wheel, driving down the runway. Then you're going to go to the level flying position, and then we're going to touch both wheels. You're going to fly down the runway with uh, both wheels in contact. And then we're going to go away. All right. Flying kill traffic, champ 15 Echo, final runway 19. Flying kill. You'll have to tell me what you're feeling for the upwind. The wind socket, one end of the runway is a little different than the other end of the runway. Is there a right crosswind or a left crosswind? 
Or is it just straight down the runway now? I guess it's just straight down the runway. Do I still want me to do a right wheel first? You can touch whichever wheel you want first. Okay. As long as you have 1500 RPM, it should all work out okay. Or even a little bit more, a little bit, maybe even 1600 RPM. Okay, we're just gonna plant the wheel. Hold it, yeah. Hold that directional control, yeah. Move. Yeah, stay with it. A little more power, we're going up the right, we're going around. <laughs> Car beats coming off. Over those trees. All right. Nice job. All right. This one you're going to do the landing of your choice. Okay. Right, I'm not gonna lie, that was probably the second sketchiest thing I've done. Yeah? <laughs> yeah. Ah, you controlled the airplane just fine. You made it do whatever you wanted to do. Especially when we did our go around, I was like with the trees, I'm like, oh no. Ah, uh, plenty of room. Would you feel disappointed if I do free point? No. Right, it's up to you. I'm gonna go for the old basic. And you know, again, you can change it halfway through the flare too. Like you might feel like, hey, this is working out to be a nice wheel landing. We're dealing with the winds and the ground and whatever comes our way. Actually. Nice job. Thank you. So I did that last minute. Yeah? That was a whole part of the plan. <laughs> All right, what's our fuel say? All right, um, half on the left tank, and I think that's half on the right tank. All right. Another uh, landing of your choice. All right. All right. What's your fuel on the left side? Left side, half. All right, let's do it. <laughs> it's funny, as soon as you get above the treetops, you get that little cross one. Oh, yeah. Ooh. Just keep your wings level. You're tipped a little to the right. There you go. Yeah, and if you have a little left crosswind, you're going to want to keep that left wing down a little bit, right? Yeah. Clank Hill Traffic, Champ 1-5, Echo turning left crosswind, one niner. Clank Hill. Oh, 
I don't see him on the ground. Oh, there he is. Off. Yep, he's just over the threshold. Clanko traffic jet 15 Echo, final runway 19, Clanko. So I would come in over the tops of those trees, right? Okay. Yeah. So yeah, he's making a nice challenge for you. That would be a shame if I were to crash that plane because I'm renting it tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> Give it, don't give it. Take it. Push that right rudder right? push yep. that right rudder. Right. Nice. I didn't like push it forward, it just like slipped out of my hand, but uh, I brought it back. Yeah, you know when I fly in the summer I wear a pair of gloves because if we're doing a lot of air work, my hands look like it's sweaty and yeah, that's no fun if it slips. Yeah. Hit it right about 55, just kind of let it float up into the air. Okay. And just maintain that 55. Yep. Right there. See that? Nice. It'll kind of fly in that ground effect around 55. Yeah. Left wing low for the wind. Straight. Yeah. Just I'm flying to the traffic, Skyhawk 637, turning left to base, the runway 19. Okay, they're coming in for a landing. We should catch them though. Clank Hill traffic, champ 15, Echo turning left downwind, runway 19 or Clank Hill. I haven't flown a Cessna in a long time. <laughs> Just got checked out into Kitty Hawk. That's 180 horsepower, GTN, 750. Nice, that's great. I used to fly the Kitty Hawk planes way, way back when. Probably, I don't know, 15 years, 20 years ago now. Oh, probably a while ago. I have the traffic in sight. Yeah, I do too. Your choice of the landing. All right. I'm gonna extend my downwind. Hey, Clank Hill traffic. Skyhawk is back up a half mile final one nine. Clank Hill. I lost him. I got him. Okay. Clank Hill traffic. Champ one five Echo is on the left downwind. We're gonna extend behind you. Yeah, we'll be number two. We've got traffic in sight. Clank Hill. Guy that has a Highlander here at Client Kill. 
thing takes off like a helicopter practically. <laughs> South Albany traffic, Piper 42 Juliet is going to turn left face, runway 19 South Albany. I don't know what engine it has in it, but it like goes straight up. I think it's a Rotax. Glencoe traffic, Champ 15 Echo, left face, runway 19, Glencoe. Clear on the right, clear on the right. And South Albany traffic, Piper 42 Juliet is uh, on final runway 19 South Albany. I'm going to go around. There's not enough room for me to land. Roger. Clank Hill traffic, jab 15 echo on the go, runway 19, Clank Hill. Safety first, never last. How's our fuel on the left tank? Left tank, it's a quarter, no, not, not quarter, it's a half. Okay. Do one more here and then we'll head back to South Albany. Okay. Since you're at 900, you could probably start your turn once you get to the end of the runway. All right. Clank Hill traffic, Jap 15 Echo, left down on runway 19, Clank Hill. Hey, Clank Hill, Skyhawk is back back, and we are clear. One time. Landing air choice. A little rocky, but it worked out. Don't move your left. Are you doing the, the your left on purpose? No. Okay. I wasn't sure if you were trying to avoid the asphalt there because you did it like three times. I was like, well, that's nice of you to okay. avoid the asphalt. <laughs> but I wasn't sure. That type of swerve, if that were on pavement, that could get pretty squirrely pretty quick. All right. Nice job, though. Nice Thank landing. You. I haven't done anything on the last three landings. All right, we'll uh, take off and head back to South Albany for a wheel landing with a nice crosswind. Oh, boy. <laughs> You're going to find it's going to be no worries.
that left wing down for that wind. Use your rudder for control, your directional control. So if you got a really, if you had a really strong crosswind, say you had a 30 knot crosswind, right? Yeah. And you let that left wing pick up, just roll ya. Now on some higher power planes, they don't want you to put an aileron control. We gotta go to the left. Left? Oh, yeah. Stay in the pattern. Yeah. I, was, I was trying to make a right pattern. Yeah. Exit. Yep. Yeah, we don't want to do that. All right. We're just too many people around here that don't have radios flying in and out. All right. Keep our eyes out for any other planes that don't have ADSB or anything. And that other person wasn't talking at all. So okay. I don't know where they are. We were coming in to land. Oh, did you hear him on the radio? No, I see him. Oh, okay. I didn't hear him announce their takeoff or their pattern at all. Thank you, traffic. Jet 15 Echo entering the left downwind for runway 19 to be departing the area to the northwest. Thank you.